Muskoka Discovery Center, um, we're, we're hoping to have it open in July. We don't have a specific date yet, but we are planning for early July at this point. Um, again, we'll wait for the next couple of weeks to see what we learn um, in terms of distancing and protocols. Uh, and hopefully no second waves are on the horizon. Um, but the Discovery Center is uh, very important to the community. We've had a lot of inquiries about when we're going to reopen so people can come and spend family time there and, and uh, uh, of course, sa safely social distancing at the same time. Um, but adjacent to the Discovery Center is our large uh, expansion that we're building right now. It's a $5.5 million project and you can actually see it across the bay. It's, uh, it's laminated wood frames that are going up very quickly with a crane. We're very excited about it. It uh, will mean an additional 15 to 18,000 uh, square feet of display space and it will have um, three amazing exhibits in it. One is going to focus on indigenous uh, histories of Muskoka. Um, the other is a modern history of, of Muskoka. Um, uh, and the third is the Wanda 3 uh, steam yacht, which we're electrifying and building a boathouse for. So she hasn't had a boathouse since we received her in 1993. Um, so this is great news that we'll finally be able to protect this artifact that we have. And uh, we're going to electrify her and resale her commercially. That's probably two years down the road, but that's the plan.